Army of Two video guide for nextgenwalkthroughs.com. Uh, this is the Iraq level. It was a pretty fun level. Uh, this later half of the level gets kind of stale, but the first part of it's pretty fun and challenging. And there's a turret in a pretty uh, well placed position defensively. Uh, it's way up top and it's really hard to hit and, uh, because you get kind of funneled through the main gate. Oh shit. Man, I'm really close to dying a couple times right there. And that P90 is incredibly inaccurate. The easiest way is just to have one person draw the attention and uh, one person flank out to the right and try to come up on the side of the turret. There we go, that motherfucker's dead now. I did most of the killing on this part of the level. I was thinking how cool it would be if during this game, like, kind of how like in Call of Duty you get plus 10 experience every time you get a kill. In this game you get like plus 50 bucks or plus 100 bucks for killing uh, any soldier that comes by and then you get plus, you know, a grand every time you kill one of the heavy armored guys. Because it's already a pretty arcadey game as it is and obviously the game's all about collecting money and killing people so why not just take it one step further. <clears throat> and also because sometimes it's really hard to tell when you kill people having that little plus 50 bucks with a little ching noise would really give you that feedback that you need sometimes when uh, you're shooting people at a distance Yeah, just keep moving your way forward, weaving your way through the boxes. And this is kind of a... I, I, I mentioned this in one of the earlier videos, how uh, in this game the the agrometer, the agrometer doesn't really work very well because... or the, the whole concept of drawing enemy fire and flanking him doesn't work very well because the game is so, like, linear that it doesn't really give you many good opportunities to... Oh wow, that guy's just unloading on me from point blank. Sit down. Shit. Anyway, like I was saying, like, the, the first part of this level right here is so, like, narrow, like, you got horse blinders on. There's only one direction you can go, and you can't really flank out very much. And that kind of defeats the whole purpose of um, uh, drawing the enemy fire so they're looking in one direction. I mean, it'd be, if it was huge battlefields where you could, you know, come in from complete different directions. Like, then it'll be a lot more effective. But so right now I'm just running back, trying to find more ammo for my guns. Because ammo is so scarce in this game, you really have to make sure that you pick up every ammo pack that that gets dropped. And this uh, this part is pretty tricky. You. It can be really tricky if you're not paying attention, but the, the best way to do it is just have one guy designated uh, to uh, covering the stairs that come up, and one guy uh, that watches the ladders on the side of the building that you're on. And you can shoot a couple of the guys at the very start, like that are hopping over the wall, but within a couple seconds, you're going to miss a couple of them, and there's going to be guys running up into the building that you're at. Yeah, as, as you can see right there, there's already a guy. Ooh, wow. Uppercut to the face. There's already some guys running up these stairs.
And they're all pretty easy to kill when they're coming up those stairs, because for some reason they don't like to shoot when they're on the stairs. Or at least when I'm sitting right at the top of it, they like to go for explicit D, but... Worked out pretty well for me. Bam. Nice little cutscene now. Listen, I'm sorry about the shit I said back there. You guys did a great job today. It's all good, man. It was good to see you again after all these years. Yeah, be safe, bro. You too. We'll grab a beer when this war is over, you son of a bitch. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Rios to Murray. Mission accomplished. Eisenhower's on the chopper. Should we proceed to extraction ourselves or... To Holy Good shit! Lord. What? What happened? That's Eisenhower's chopper. Eisenhower's helicopter, it... it just blew up. Shit. I'll call the DOD. 